is up guys welcome back to the channel and today we're gonna be playing some plants versus zombies uh, so yeah let's get started I guess start adventure <laughs> spooky hand uh, I already did continue the game um, I did get started on the first level but let's just start over I'm sure you guys know how plants versus zombies works it's basically uh, you plant plants to protect your home from zombies. It's as simple as that. So, yep. Yeah, got our first plant here, the pea shooter. Keep collecting sun, you'll need it to grow more plants. Oh, yeah, this one costs 100 sun. The zombies are coming. Here they come. Brains. But yeah, this is a very, very easy level. You don't have to do anything. You just plant in a single row. There's actually no strategy in this level. I guess you just wait. But yeah, um, once you finish the tutorial levels, it's gonna have it's gonna have like all five lanes, and then it's gonna get a little bit harder. All right, I'm planning on doing an entire series of this entire game, so I'm I'm excited. All right. Won the first level and we won the sunflower. I'm sure you guys know what this does. Gives you additional sun. 50 sun. It only costs 50 sun. I'm pretty sure we get three lanes now. Yep. Now we have three lanes. Sunflowers are an extremely important plant. Try to plant at least three of them. Okay. Such a specific number, too. That's weird. The more sunflowers you have, the faster you can grow plants. Yep, that's... Kinda obvious. I'm gonna put, like, um... This level's gonna be super easy, but I don't know. I'm gonna put two lanes of sunflowers. The zombies are coming. Here they come. All right, so far so good. I don't expect there to be a challenge. This is the second level. There we go. Sorry if um, I'm not talking sometimes. I just don't know what to say. These few levels are so easy and there's nothing to do. We're just breezing through these levels. I don't remember what plant you get after the second level. I think it's either the walnut or the landmine. The potato mine. I'm pretty sure we get the walnut though. Alright, final wave. Or maybe you get the cherry bomb. But I'm pretty sure you get the one. I have not played this game in years. I actually don't remember a lot of the plants. Oh, you get the cherry bomb, okay. Nice. 150 sun and it blows up all the zombies in an area. Oh, now we get some cone heads. So now we have a little bit more of a challenge. All right, we still have three lanes. Coneheads are a little bit stronger than normal zombies, but they're still like, they're not that much of a challenge. All you need is two pea shooters in one lane and they're pretty much gonna die. All right, we can let that guy come closer. Start sieving up on some sun here. All right, now we'll place a pea shooter. I'm playing it a little bit risky here. Thank you. 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I didn't think he was gonna die. Alright, that was, um, pretty stupid of me. Alright, let's not do that stupid mistake again. I was expecting the plant to kill the zombie a lot faster, but I guess not. I mean, it wouldn't be a fun game if it wasn't a challenge. And this is only just the beginning. If you get far enough in the game, there's gonna be gigantic zombies. And there's some pretty powerful zones, too. Okay, so now this is our very first cone head. Alright, come on. Hurry up. There we go. Alright, let's stall him a little bit. Oh, we might have to plant another one. No, I think I think he's good right there. Yep, he got it. Alright, final wave is about to start. Do you guys think that the cone heads are a challenge? Nope. The bucket heads are gonna be the real challenge. It's basically a cone head, but just a lot stronger. There we go. All right, we get the walnut. 50 sun, and basically it stalls the zombie. Blocks off zombies and protects your other plants, yep. Only thing is that it takes a long, long time to recharge the seed packet. All right, we still get uh, cone heads. Oh, now we have five lanes. Still no match for me, but you know, at least we have the entire lawn now for a change. Let's do two lanes of uh, sunflowers. Alright, I learned my mistake. I'm not gonna let him get too close before I plant my so We're gonna plant it as soon as we can. There we go. I was playing it a little bit too risky last time. Comes another one. Alright, so far so good. Alright, we're almost done planting sunflowers. I think I'm gonna do like um, five levels per episode. So we're just gonna, I think, beat this level and then we're gonna beat the next level. And then that'll be an episode. Alright. So far, oh, there comes our first cone head of the level. There are no match for me. Not at all. There we go.
Oh wow, we got a lot of pea shooters now. We, we're trying to get three lanes. Yeah, they're definitely not going to get past us. I'm a little rusty at this game because I think last time I played it was like on the Xbox 360, which was years and years and years ago. I did play a little bit of it on the phone, but I never beat it on the phone because, you know. I don't know. I actually don't know why I never beat it on the phone. Alright, let's blow him up. Ba-boom! Nice. Oh, we got a shovel. Now if we plant a uh, plant on the wrong place, we can shovel it and take it off. Shovel it out. As you dig up a plant to make room for another one. Yep. Oh, he's going to give us a demonstration. <laughs> Greenies, neighbor. <laughs> the name's Crazy Day. <laughs> but you can just call me Crazy Day. <laughs> Listen, I got a surprise. <laughs> but first, I'll need you to clear your lawn. <laughs> Use your shovel and dig up those plants. <laughs> Let the dean commence, alright? Simple enough. Okay, good. Goody. Now for the surprise. We're going bowling. Oh, I love these levels. Here, take this walnut. Why did I put a walnut in your hand? Crazy. Now go bowl me a winner. I love these levels. So it's like, you basically use the walnuts as like bowling balls. Watch this. And you can get combos. Since they move to the sides after you hit a zombie, you can get like some crazy combos. Just like that. You can get Oh, let's save up those explosive ones because the red ones explode. Screw it, we'll use it right now. Oh, oh my god, I did not expect that one to die. We just wasted a perfectly good explosive walnut. And even if they do get close, we got like five lawnmowers, so... I'm telling you, these first few levels are insanely easy. Alright, final wave. In the middle right there. Last one, boom, and we get a potato mine. All right, basically, it explodes. It's simple as that. Explodes on contact, but it does take time to arm itself. Yeah, it stays on the ground for a little bit. But um, yeah, this is gonna be the last uh, level we do for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you can, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.